Hey YouTube, it's me again. Um, and yes, I'm officially sick this morning. So I tried to run out last night to Walgreens and um, pick up some stuff to um, hurry up and get rid of the cold before I actually got it, which used to work for me sometimes because <laughs> I don't really like taking medicines. But um, it usually works if I go ahead and get something when I feel it coming on. And then I just, you know, use it every four hours or whatever for a day. And then I'll be able to get rid of it. Now, mind you, I only used it once last night. I'm probably going to take another set now. But, um, yeah, I think it might be too late. So, anyhow, um, I'm here today with one of my Shop With Me Saturdays. Um, I have a couple things that I picked up from Michael's. No, I'm lying. Don't let me do that to you guys. Um, Joanne's. Hobby Lobby, um, the thrift store, and an estate sale. So, oh, garage sales too. So anyhow, let me get right into it because I'm going to try to break this up into two brief videos. So first off, I got all of these cute, like very charming, like first of all, let me tell you about this place. It was like a 3000 um, square foot home in a charming little neighborhood in my old neighbor. I mean, in my own town. Um, the house was like 3,000 square feet. I mean, they had things in there that were like $2,200. Um, a lot of their wood furniture was amazing. But by the time I got there, um, it was all gone. So, um, yeah, and I'm not really in the market for that right now. Anyhow, um, I have to find a house first before I can do that. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm so sorry, guys, if I'm sniffling in your ear. I am so sorry. I apologize. Um, but I am backed up on video, so I do have to do these. Um, okay. So, um, at one, at the estate sale, um, they had a lot of Christmas stuff. And these were very unique to me, so I ended up picking these up. Um, I need to look up um, some of the information on the bottom and see how old these are but I'm pretty sure they're pretty old because everything in there was you know um, well seasoned or <laughs> you know um, older basically so um, yeah look at these uh, balls I thought these were really cute I got that style there's like four of those um, and this one with the little cherub on it um, and I think I got about four of those. And then there's about six of these little ones right here. And these are my favorite because they look kind of vintage shabby. So these are my favorites. And whoever it is was a crafter because they went ahead and put this ribbon here instead of the original string that went with it. But I think those little balls are gorgeous. So I ended up getting that. Um... Sorry, guys. Um, I found this at a garage sale. Um, it does have a real working little uh, hanging piece there. This one is a cologne or a perfume bottle. So it doesn't have anything at the bottom. I ended up picking up this pitcher. I don't have one of these yet. And I don't know that I'm going to keep it for my own collection. I think this is something that I'm definitely going to go ahead and put in the booth. Um, let's see, I ended up picking up this necklace, um, it was labeled broken necklace, so, you know, broken doesn't mean anything to, um, us crafters, so I went ahead and picked it up anyhow, um, I think it's gorgeous, um, I don't know if it's some kind of jade, um, I don't know, I don't know what type of material it is, but I just really, really like it. Um, I ended up picking up this camera. The way they did things were, when I went there, it was 50% off. But later, like an hour later, it was going to be, um, an hour later, it was going to be 75% off. So they made everybody go out, and then you have to come back in if you wanted to get the 75% off. Which sucks to me, but I did it anyways, because I kind of wanted this camera. And I have a small little collection that I've started of old cameras. Um, but I'm not sure if I'm going to put this one in the booth. Or if I'm going to keep this one for my collection. I ended up finding this note glass thing. And this is going to go in my booth after I clean it up a bit. Um, 
I ended up finding this one. And although I do love, love, love the top, I'm not crazy about the etching at the bottom um, or this stuff around here. So I'm probably going to go ahead and put that in the booth. Um, same with this one. I'm really not a fan of the grapes and vines. That's just me and my preference. So I think that this here with the lid is going to go in the booth. Now this one, I'm debating if I want to keep it or not. Because, yeah, I really, really like this one. I have a tiny one like this, but I wouldn't mind having one like this either. To add to my collection. Um, this is just a table runner that I picked up. Oh, excuse me, I'm so sorry. It's just a table runner that I picked up, and I thought it was pretty cute, so. Um, and then here's another. I think they were stapled together. And then here's like a tablecloth, like a round tablecloth that was also there. This doily was at that estate sale. And I stopped picking up like normal looking doilies and I'm starting to try to find more eccentric ones. This here I found at the thrift store. And anybody knows me and my vintage babies are like my favorite thing. So, I ended up picking up these two. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, okay, I'll do this and then I'll go to the next video. Um, this tin can I thought was adorable um, and very vintage. So, I decided to get this. And I don't know if I want to add this to my kitchen because I have like that rooster yellow and red and thing going on in there or if I'm going to put that in the and then I'll just do these two and move on to the next video and then these two I found at an estate sale um, and I just love this one here it's very unique I've never seen anything like it um, and it was like that big old bundle right here around that chipboard so I took that and then this one is really really I have some similar to this but it's not this soft um, so I picked up this, and there's a whole wad of that, too, on this here thingy. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll be back soon with the next video. Um, stay tuned. Bye.